Hello again viewers, outside Lost Brothers, just been in there to charge my phone. Nice friendly staff, a couple of wee cokes and they gave me some nuts, always a bonus. <laughs> We're at Ben O'Madena Marina and I've came here far too late, I'm way behind schedule doing videos. We just get caught up doing stuff and had a few issues. Anyway, let me show you what the marina's like at half past ten at night. Quite a few people have asked me to come back here. There is a few different places from the last time I was here. I don't know if this was here last time. There's also a bar around the corner that I've missed called Bobby's. It's been completely done up and different. I can tell you for sure and Neil's was here. So if you're in the mood, that's the place to go. Looks nice in there. How are you doing? All right. How are you doing? I'm not bad. I'm watching you all the time. Thanks very much. How are you doing? I I'm just I'm here for five days, so I'm just going to bit the cost of Del Sol. You're in Portugal. That's right. It was in Portugal a couple of weeks ago, so I'm just here for five days. Oh, enjoy yourself. Oh, thanks a lot. Where are you guys from? Glasgow. Glasgow, okay. Hill, Hill. Oh, Celtic fan, eh? All right. Lovely to meet you guys. Take care. Bye, bye. How unexpected is that viewers right at the start of the walk to meet viewers from Glasgow? <laughs> There's the news. Can a late night bar this? Doesn't get busy till later on. As you can see it's pretty busy just now. I've got to ask the guys' names here, but anyway, lovely meeting you. So they're probably just heading home and I'm just I've just arrived here. Definitely came too late, but anyway. Some bars will be empty, I think. Some bars will be busier. There's quite a few bars open quite late here in Mombasa. It's a lovely marina. Um, somebody did mention in the comments whenever I do a, a video at marina, somebody did say, Kevin, all marinas are nice. That's kind of true, isn't it? When you think about it, it's kind of true. Some are nicer than others, I'd say, to be fair. Don't know. Depends on your preference. Porto Bonus Marina is lovely. Um, but it's pricey. <laughs> Here's the boat if you want to be a boat trip. We'll just head round the corner, we'll show you some other bars and restaurants. I think this one was here last time I was here, it's pretty busy inside here. Quite a few restaurants here that are nice for fish, as they should be really in this location. Pinocchio restaurant, there's one in there in as well, it's busy in there. Jeez. Hi. It's busy. Pizza, €6.90, so pretty decent. Getting busy around here, viewers. I'll need to speak over some of the music. At this time of night, there's going to be music pretty loud here. Let's cross the road. There used to be a sports bar on the right hand side here, I don't know if it's still here. Has it changed? Let me see. Morrison's Irish Pub. I don't remember that's been here last time. I thought it was one of the Hollywood, Foster's Hollywood sports bars. But Maybe I've got mixed up between um, Porto Benus, which is definitely possible. So, traditional Irish pub. Look at the big massive TV they've got inside. TV's brilliant inside. Stretches all the way back. Looks like a good bar. Don't know if there's any live music on. What was that? Three tourist bus. Still going at this time of night. That's the hardcore on the bus at this time. <laughs> Butterfly Park getting advertised. Let's cross over. You can get around the back entrance. Um, I was staying in the Hotel Palmasol the last time and it's just at the back of here. But let's get around here. Came here too late, but at the same point I'm showing you the kind of nightlife right here. So I might, if I get time, I'll come back and do a video during the day. But I don't know if I'll have time, to be honest with you. It's busy enough anyway. The train's going really slow, isn't it? Right, right around there. Okay, let's go. Can't remember exactly what bars and restaurants are around here, but we'll see in a minute. I, I do get confused between the two. Yep, I do get confused between the two marinas. It's nice, the buddy. That's nice. So this is the Mexican restaurant and they've got some entertainment inside, some live music. Which is pretty nice if you have a nice wee meal. 
nice atmosphere, isn't it, viewers? A lot of families here. Most of the resorts in the Costa del Sol are very family friendly. There, there is obviously nightlife around at 24 hours square for the young ones. Nightclubs open to 4 or 5 in the morning. And as the name suggests, there used to be nightclubs open 24 hours there. I don't know if they are now. Or they used to be open during the night, basically, to the morning. It's still busy for this time, isn't it? Yeah, people having their dinner at half 10, 11 o'clock at night. I think I had an Indian here, I'll need to remember if I go by. I think it was in the Cinnamon Lounge, let's see if it's still here. It was okay. I've not had an Indians on this trip at all, I've just been eating tapas everywhere I go. Quite a few steakhouses. Let me know in the comments, do you prefer evening or daytime videos? I think sometimes in the daytime you see more, just the nature of it. But I think it's good to see it at night, see the lights. Something a bit different, isn't it? And I'm glad it's busy, because I thought it'd be really quiet this time. There it is, Cinnamon Club. Up the stairs to the Cinnamon Club. Got a couple of wee cheap shops here actually. You'd think it'd be quite high end, but it's not really, kind of mix. You've got some shops around the other side that are more high end. Head just round there, viewers, not too far, not too far. There was a wee pound shop down here last time I was here, I don't know if it's still here. Has it survived everything? I don't know. Shop's still open late here. It's not like the UK, we're used to shops shutting so early in the UK, aren't we? Eight, nine o'clock. When you get weather like this, you're walking about shorts and t-shirt, you don't mind going anywhere. Makes a difference. What boat do you fancy of yours? What one? A few nice ones. Okay, so that's still here. Remember that one there, the Angus restaurant, you got the stairs to it. Fancy a wee football top, guys get everything there. Bags as well, looking good. Oh, lad ladies considering it. There's going to be haggling going on there in a minute. <laughs> Popcorn and ice cream over here. Tutti Fruity reminds me of Nerha. I've done a wee video on Nerha at half past one in the morning showing you Tutti Fruity Square. Quite busy, it's like night and day, the difference is amazing. Up to about 10 o'clock at night, nobody's in the place. And then it's almost as if the bus every day in at midnight, it's jumping. It's really un unbelievable the difference. Okay, let's go. More shops here. What's the ladies' shops I've noticed? souvenir shop as well. Need to move on from that one but quite lively in there. Cocktails five euros yours five euros standard small beer two euros here and a pint three euros not too bad is it a pint sitting at a marina for three euros can't complain can you Here we go, what one do you fancy? What one? Do you wonder if they're real cocktails or is it just artificial? I think it's artificial viewers. I'm not going to try one to find out. Still busy there. Okay. Prison Island up the top there, you see that? Still quite a few people in there. Steakhouse up the top as well, you can see that. Restaurants all over the place. The wee dog, it's tiny. <laughs> it's absolutely tiny. I could have stepped over that here. Yeah. It's 
continue around. There might be a few more bars and restaurants around here. We cut through there, through the back to some other bars and restaurants. If I can remember, I might go through there, we'll see. It's a bit quieter when we come to the end here. Can't remember really what's up there, I don't think there's much up there. Yeah, I don't think there is much up there. Restaurant Portobello, been here since 1992. Look at all the information we're giving you here. <laughs> Shops here as well, diving centre. I can't remember 100% from memory, I don't think there's much up there. Can I get around this side? Or can I cut through a shopping centre? I'm not sure. Let's see who else. Sea life there, sorry. Should have mentioned that, sea life. Are there any families here? Here's a two euro shop, I think it's moved. This is the one I was talking about. Here's a pound shop, but it's two euros, not bad. Yeah, I don't think there's much else up there. Let's go up here. Let's see if I can cut round the back. Oh, traffic, traffic. Okay, viewers. A wee beach club down here. Not too busy. A few people in. But a lovely wee setting. Nice. Let's just cut around the corner. Still watching? Superstar, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Came here too late, but I showed the marina when really it's probably at its busiest to be honest with you in a lot of the bars. They'll get a wee bit busier, but maybe eight, nine o'clock, better time to come and show you. Let me go on the pavement viewers. Hold on. <laughs> if you're still watching then I hope you're enjoying the videos and if you've not already subscribed, hit the wee red button. I just mention it at the end of most videos because I know you'll forget. Thanks so much for all your support, I really appreciate it. I hope you've enjoyed the videos from Costa del Sol, Tori Molinos, Benamadena, Nerha. More videos to come, maybe, from other places as well. Okay, I'm trying to figure out my bearings here, viewers. Hold on, hold on a minute. Got a week in a market down here, it's quite nice. Another week in a promenade down there. But I'm heading round this way. I was going to show you the back end. There's some more bars and restaurants. I think it's around here, from memory. Maybe I'll get mixed up. Mm. Okay, see people going down here. Hopefully I'm right, viewers. Hopefully I'm right. Yeah, okay. So round the back we've got some more bars that I'm going to show you. I'm hoping that I can get down here to show you. Oh yeah, steps here. So there's a wee shopping centre there, there's got a couple of kids rides and stuff in it, but not much else. Here we go. If you've got family and you're coming to Beno Madonna, you'll be glad you've watched this to the end because all the wee kids rides around here. Oh, it's hot here. Okay, so inside the shopping centre, got various wee shops, wee toy shop as well. Kids rides, stuff going on there as well. We've also got a few bars here. I'm trying to remember how I got to the Hotel Parmesan. Around there, I think it's up there. I'm gonna head up there in a minute. So, we've got Molly's Irish Bar. It's quite interesting because this is a Monday night. I was here the last time in this bar, never had more than two or three people in it. It's definitely got a lot busier, without a doubt. Right, 
So, without a doubt, it's got busier. It's Molly's. How you doing? All right, aye. You guys from Scotland? Aye. Aye. How you doing? Yes. Oh, don't put me in life. All right, okay. No, no worries. No, okay, where are you from? Uh, Cumbernauld. Cumbernauld, okay. You having a nice holiday? Oh, it's good, thank you. Enjoying it? Where else have you been isn't it? Paisley. Where are you from? Roasting. Originally from Paisley. Oh, Paisley? Aye, Paisley, aye. So I'm just here doing some videos. So I thought I'd show the marina. Nearly 11 o'clock at night. Ah, I can't beat it. That's Beautiful. it. Oh, nice speaking to you. I do. Aye. Take care. All the best. Enjoy the rain. You can post me if you want. I don't care. All right. What's, what's your name? Okay, Cam, nice to meet you. Cheers. Cheers, guys. See you later. See you later. So, the guys just live down the road to me in Scotland. So, we've got Molly's Sports Bar here. As I said, a lot busier than the last time I was here, without a doubt. We have got another couple of restaurants and bars down here as well. You can also get in the back some of the restaurants here as well. Uh, Jack's Bar as well. Quite a nice wee setting here. Get into the shisha pipes and do it there. That's Jack's Smokehouse. We'll see if I can show you the name. Jack's Smokehouse. Most of these you can cut through to the back. There's a, an entrance for the cinnamon lounge as well. Somewhere here. How you doing? Oh, okay. As you're seeing it, the Hotel Palmasol, you just got up the hill there. Walk around the corner. You're at 24 hour square the night night uh, club but I'm going there in a minute. I'll see how busy it is. I'm not going in anywhere of yours, honestly, I'm not. I'm not going in anywhere at all. <laughs> okay, so get an Asian restaurant here, Sakura. Another uh, steakhouse here as well. So that's the front and the back of the marina. I did miss the very start of it. Apologies. At the very start, there's Burger King and there's a couple of wee bars, but I didn't miss much. Just another steakhouse here as well. Don't think there's much more around there. Hotel Parmesan is around there. If you want to go up to 24 hour square, there's some more bars and restaurants up there as well. Thanks so much for watching. Absolute pleasure meeting the guys from Glasgow and Cumbernauld. Brilliant to meet fellow Scots on my travels. Brilliant to meet people from all around the world to be honest with you. And I've been so surprised on this trip in the Costa del Sol that I'm managing to meet people who watch the channel um, it's amazing, it's brilliant. Thanks for all your support, I really appreciate it. Um, don't forget, give it a wee thumbs up if you don't mind, or thumbs down if you've not enjoyed it. Either way, it's fine, honestly. It's fine. Um, I'm away to the nightclubs. See you on the next one, viewers. Goodbye.